Mike, check, test, sting, one, two, three, four. Sounds pretty good. All right, let's make sure that my sound check is where it needs to be on here. Mike, check, test. Yeah, sounds good. All right, let's bring that volume down a tad bit, though. All right, awesome. Happy New Year, first and foremost. New Year same but different chords all right let's do a little playing warm-up all that good stuff um and we start in up in about nine minutes for my patreon so yeah let's do it i'm gonna actually turn my mic off and move this um out the way so i can like practice and get into a little bit of a vibe you know what i'm saying a little bit of a vibe all right check in with you guys momentarily Hey, thank you so much to, I gotta bring this over so I can see it better. I might actually leave this right here. Uh, I don't know if that's an ideal spot for this, but that's fine. Uh, Lumen, how do you pronounce your name? Luminal Abnormality, that's pretty cool. It's a cool name, very like mysterious, I might say, but I, I, I like it, I like it, it's a cool name. Yeah, you know, it's not as cool as Court Master, but it is close. Which camera, this camera or this camera? Right there, not this camera, obviously, right? But yeah, Happy New Year to you as well. Thank you so much. Appreciate it.
I work on the heart as a day job. It's terminology from that. Ah, coordinator. I have ah, interesting. Well, look, I learned something new. I learned something new. All right. So, what are your New Year's resolutions? What are you improving, if anything, about yourself? Or are you one of those perfect beings who doesn't have anything that needs to be improved? There's no such thing as like a person who's that, right? Or is there? That's so cool. Boom, boom, boom. As the dun 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 is evolving. As the dun 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 is evolving. And the gun dun 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 Just as he dun 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 you can pursue the mission. two more chords from that. So I don't remember the next one. I don't know. I have to, once we start officially start this uh, eight o'clock Eastern time Patreon here, I'll do the screen share and see because I don't remember those last two chords, but I do like that. Uh, let's see what other... So let's see. Also, that's fine. So, so you can rest your mind and show that I'll, that I'll be loving you always. Oh, C, my, C sharp minor F7. Yeah. 
F sharp seven. F sharp seven is what? So here. Mm. Oh, so hang, wait, 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 wait. So we got these two. Okay, there we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right. Boom, 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 boom. You can rest your heart and show that I'll be loving you all the way. Boom, boom, boom. Dun, 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 dun. So it's like, let me, let me run it from the top again. So it's like, uh, dun, dun, dun. let's actually get some singing going here too. And it was buzzing on in early May. Do we need a little reverb up on this voice? I think we might. That I'll be loving you always. So. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Wait, so it's. Mm -mm, so it's. Do, 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 do. Bring that a little closer. So. Do. Mm, but that's. All right, so let me see something here. So we kind of want, we want to hear myself louder. We can turn this lower and we can also turn this lower, no? Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's pretty good. Do, 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 do. Mm, those, mm, mm. Do, 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 mm, do. Mm. Do, 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 as around the sun, okay, so as around the sun, the earth knows she's revolving, and the rosebuds know to bloom in early May, just as hate loves, just as hate knows that love's a cure, and you can rest your mind assured that I'll be loving that I'll be loving you always. Ah. So. There we go. That's it. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Dance, da, 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 all right, let's find that back. But also, I don't know if I want, well, a couple things here. First of all, I really need to figure out the deal with this mixer because I'm using this mixer here, this roll and go mixer that I, I don't think is the right mixer for this setup. So ideally, I, I would have loved for this keyboard to have um, class compliant C, class compliant, class, class compliant for it to be class compliant so i can like connect my phone directly via usb but it doesn't have that maybe one day it might get it i don't know but because it doesn't have it i need to like route my audio from this to a mixer that does have class compliant c why do i keep saying it awkward like that 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 is class compliant uh and connect that to my phone the issue is is that now it's another thing to like have to deal with levels and such um, and I'm also not monitoring through that mixer. I'm monitoring directly through here. So as I see like the, the, the red input, like right now it's showing red on here to show that maybe this is too loud. I'm talking too loud. So I can like bring the level lower or bring it a little further from my mouth like there and increase it. So maybe something like, yeah, maybe this might be better to keep it a little further like that. All right. So yeah, that's good. But okay. Anyway, let's get back to it. So it's, it's like five minutes past. I'm gonna I'm gonna be here the whole time. So I know at least one person from the Patreon said he wasn't able to join, which is perfectly fine. Um, but I'm gonna keep obviously keep it on. I want to just practice consistency to the best of my ability. And this is also fun for me to have a you know reprieve from life to just come here because I actually look forward to this immensely. Um, so let's get back to it. So I'm gonna go back to also why am I taking my glasses off? Like I have great vision. What was I? What was I just thinking just now? You know, like what was I thinking? All right, so we're gonna go back to it, but we wanted to switch to piano sound. That's what I was coming here for, actually. Let's see. So, 
at the store too. Do, 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 do. Yeah, so that's good. So I can hear myself much clearer and I don't have to have the mic so close to my face. So that's dope. And also, what's this level looking like? Do, 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 do. There we go. Do, 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 do. And da, 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 da. All right. Do, 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 do. Should we give myself more reverb, maybe? Let's give myself a little more reverb, right? Let's live a little on the edge. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Around the sun, the earth knows she's revolving, and the rosebuds know the oh, so it's in the room, and the rosebuds know the bloom in early May. Just as hate knows that love's a cure, and you can rest your mind assure that I'll, that I'll be loving. So this part I have to get down, so that I'll be loving you always. So I need that, that part. Let me see. So. Perfect. Again. So this is the key. Like when you're, when you're learning piano or maybe learning anything, like one of the important things is just like continue to practice. Um, hang on. Let me chat with uh, my man, Geoff Ashley. How are you doing? Well, let me finish my thought. It's to continue, like practice the parts that are challenging and keep practicing it until it's not as challenging. Anyway, uh, got a piano in the house a little over a year ago and started learning jazz piano. I was a jazz trumpet player in high school, dope. So it's expanding upon my previous knowledge. Which go mixer is it? I have the first one. The TX6 was a fantastic, was a fantastic and well worth upgrade from the Roland. Oh, that's fire, man. Um, so first of all, thanks for joining first and foremost. And that's cool that you played jazz trumpet in high school. Um, and uh, yeah, so you bring up a really good point, which is that I have a TX6, as you may or may not know. Um, and I kind of want a permanent solution for the mixer problem that I have here. Uh, and I don't know if the TX6 is a permanent solution because um, that is a mobile option and this is not mobile. And so if I have that connected here, there's gonna be times where I wanna use it um, when I'm at coffee shops and things like that. But I think just to not overthink things, I think what could be a good idea is to, you know, disconnect this roll and go mixer. And this is the roll and go mixer pro X, by the way, I think it's like a 150 or something like that. And, um, I think it's great for what it is, but yeah, I mean, I think, I guess what I'm trying to say is I don't see myself ever using this go mixer X or pro X, um, as a mobile solution because I have the TX six, which is much better and it's much more mobile. Um, and if I connect the TX six to this rig, I need like a permanent option for this. And I don't want to have to like disconnect it when I'm going somewhere and then reconnect it back here. So I have to figure that out. Um, but that doesn't mean that I can't like say, Oh, for the next session that I have here, for example, like try with the TX six and like connect it and see how that feels and sounds and everything like that. Um, yeah, it's not a bad idea. I mean, just to try it out and kind of see what how that how that goes. What have you been using your TX64 mostly as of late? Do you like use it in the studio? Do you use it like out and about or what? All right, let's get back to some more chords. But so that was the part that I was working on. So 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 it's like I'll be loving you all. Lot of movement, right? Do, do, do. Also, there's like other sounds on here. Let me let me re rem uh, remind myself how to get to uh, the other. Um, how do we do that? It's edit. Okay. So first of all, I can take reverb off, and I can go to edit here, and then I think if I go to master effects, I think I can change voice. Yeah. So I'm gonna like go to maybe like a delay one or something. Test, test, test. 
modulation delay, modulation delay. Tap, pan delay. tap pan delay cool cool all right let's go to regular go delay regular delay do 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 uh which one of these is just like a lot less a level 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 do 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 yeah maybe, yeah, maybe something like this. Like this. I mean, I mean, you don't really you don't want really delay. You delay. You, you really want really reverb want reverb here. So let's go. Let's go back to uh, what is it? EQ test no EQ settings. Okay, that we don't really care about. And what does NS do? Noise suppress threshold. This thing is so deep. What this keyboard is able to do, and it can be overwhelming if you if you're not careful. But yeah, let's go back here and let's um. All right, we got some responses from my guy, Geoff Ashley. The TX6 was a fantastic, so far just home with my Moog Sound Studio, original and open one feel and the fire with my Moog Sound Studio, original and open one feel and the OPZ. Wow, just got it about two weeks ago and I'm still learning it. And that's awesome, man. So you probably, I'm assuming maybe you've seen some of my content uh, using that same equipment that you just mentioned. So one of the things that that's a lot of fun for me, I was at a coffee shop the other day and I took my, let's see, OPZ and connected. I had like a small little portable, like this long um, cable and I connected my OPZ uh, headphone output to the input uh, of the OP1 field. And then I connected my OP1 field USB to my phone and via the lightning you know, cable. And I was able to have that set up right there. I didn't even have, Sometimes I can also connect like my field to my M1 Teenage Engineering headphone headset thing and I can talk as well. But in this case, I was just in a coffee shop and I just wanted to like vibe out and like do like a live set kind of thing. And that setting, that setup right there is just so much fun. And it's it's amazing to me because like the 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 OPZ is like just a incredible um performance tool, in my opinion. Um, and, and sequencer, sequencer and performance tool. It's like it, it, you can. I have such. I have so many just beats and so much good stuff on there. So like I can. I was playing playing them on there and you know jamming out, and then I was improvising o over it with the OP one field, and it was just like okay, this is this is something special here. So I see myself like doing that exact setup, having that setup, um, maybe even that plus this thing over here, which maybe we can talk a little bit about right now too. Um, the the OB4 and uh, and having this as like a mobile rig setup. So certainly I live in New Jersey. So once the weather picks up a little bit here, like in the spring, I can see myself absolutely going to like a boardwalk somewhere and just setting up shop and just jamming out. Like that's something I have to be not afraid to do and just do it because that would just be so much fun to do. Um, yeah. So uh, let me actually see one of these things on here. I was uh, messing around with the, I want to see how this sounds through here too. The um, disc mode on the OB4 now has uh, the ability to store loops on it, which is really, really cool. And so now I don't have to have anything connected. And so I can just go like this, right? But let me go to some other sound. I said you gotta put me on, but need the apple bone. You gotta put me on, but need the apple bone. I said you gotta put me on, but need the apple bone. See, it's a little off with the with the um. With the, it's not perfect. The loop. I said you gotta put me on, but need the apple bone. I said you gotta put me. What else we have on here? Oh. So it's just it's just mad dope that you can do this stuff on here now. Now, what do they need to do next? As I turn the reverb off, because it's a little obnoxious. They need to, I mean, who am I to say what a company needs to do? But we I would like to have um more control over uh management of the loops that are on there. Cause right now all you can do is like hit the button and it just skips from one to the next to the next. Um, but yeah, so we got some more stuff in here. So 
got the M1s too. The field ecosystem is just amazing. I can't wait for an OP. Man, uh, Geoff, yeah, I I think when that comes out or if that comes out, um, I, uh, yeah, I just, I can't even begin to explain how exciting that is. Um, it's going to be fire. So my man, Cody, what's going on? What's going on? Thanks for joining. What's up, Cord? Happy New Year. I'm on iOS now. About to start working with AUM and Koala. A lot to learn. Great to see you, man. What's up, everyone else? Yeah, man. Appreciate you being here. I don't know. I think this might be your first time in one of one of my live streams. Maybe I don't remember, but you certainly always show love and um, you know on my videos and stuff. So I definitely appreciate that. And thanks for for hanging out. And no subject says play minuet and G major. Um, remind. I'll look it up in a second. Um, if you say please. I'll look it up and I'll, I'll like maybe learn some of it live. Cause I don't think I, I don't think I know that one. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, Cody says, I'm super excited to hit you and your man, Henny. Dope. Don't, don't hit me too hard though. I don't want to get injured. What am I, what am I talking about? Um, but yeah, man, appreciate you, man. And Geoff says, uh, NJ nice. I was born and raised on long Island, but spent my teenage and adult years. Ah, very cool. What part of Florida? Me too. Love, love that song too. Uh, for the tutorials didn't know the ob4 save loops that's clutch yeah it, it's a it's a really dope feature um that this is cool let's turn to something totally different so this is for those of you who don't know so i have a patreon that i teach chord progressions and music theory uh every sunday night at 8 p.m eastern standard and um that's what this is but no one showed up today but that's okay one person messaged me and said he wasn't gonna be able to and also this is new year's day so i mean i kind of have expected it but I, you know, I wanted to be here and so I'm happy to be here, but I think the important thing is like, is the live stream component here, right? Uh, so you guys can chat and join and this makes it just a more interactive and it's just dope that Zoom has the ability to live stream directly right from the, from my mobile phone um, to YouTube so that, you know, you guys can kind of be in on the, on the mix of what's happening and stuff. And uh, yeah, so I appreciate everyone being here. Uh, any suggestions for Lydia and core progressions? Yes, yeah, sorry for the not full. Uh, no problem, no problem. Uh, suggestions for Lydia and core progressions. You know what? Um, let me. I know that's a mode, and I don't. I don't know. Lydia and chord progressions. Let's. If I were to Google that, let's see what comes up. It says five Lydia mode core progress. So I appreciate you asking because I'm actually genuinely excited right now to like learn this live. And why the heck not? Uh, Brooksville, it's an hour north of Tampa. Just moved up here from uh, out there after COVID. Gotcha, gotcha. Very cool, very cool. All right, so my man asked about Lydian chord progressions. So Lydian is a mode, and I just Googled, I want to like, I want to I want to play maybe a few of these chord progressions. Matter of fact, why, why am I not doing this like on the screen? Let's do, a, let's do a screen share here maybe and show you guys what I'm seeing. Let me see, Lydian chord progression this is actually a lot of fun I'm, I'm having i'm very much enjoying this this is this is dope that people are here and vibing and all that good stuff so let me do screen share the only thing about doing a screen share now is that if anyone does join from the patreon i'm not gonna see it but i will check back periodically because it is 20 minutes past so i'll just have to be mindful but that's okay so let me see let's go uh no 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 here and this is what what i'm what i want to play so <clears throat> we're talking about lydian chord progressions let's keep this up here um and let's let's learn one so let me close this open this back up and all right hopefully y'all could see that now i think you should be able to um also is there any way to make i guess you can't see me i guess it's just the uh that's fine. You don't need to see me. All right. So the first one I'm working in F Lydian, all C major, C major notes on the song. Oh, that's dope. I've been learning a lot from Koala Bcast crew on Discord, a wealth of information if you can make it. Oh, dope. I, I've joined one of their, um, man, I haven't used Koala in a minute. There's so much stuff to learn and, new, and, and use. And for me, it's like, yo, let's just use what feels right. Right. And right now what feels right is like diving back into like this and, um, and you're taking advantage of this opportunity to, to be able to have access to so much crazy equipment, including the heads, headphones I'm wearing now. And yeah. All right. I, I think I made a, I made a video. I don't know if I released it yet. I, I'll be talking about it a little bit more soon, but anyway. Um, so let's take a look at this. So the first one says C a minor D E minor, a minor D C. 
So let's learn how to play this chord progression right now. So we're going from C to A minor. So from C to A minor, there are, let's see how many notes are in common, right? So from C to A minor, oh, wow, there's a, quite a few notes in common, right? And then from here, A minor is A, C, E. And so all we need to do is jump up to here. So when I say here, I mean from G to A in the right hand. D major, E minor. And then we go from E minor. I don't, that sounds kind of, that doesn't sound that good to me, <laughs> but hang on. back to A minor again, so we can go. So from here, we can do, I guess the best A minor from this is. That's just, that's a weird chord progression. It doesn't sound that good to me. Um, let me see what I hit, listen. I mean, this is probably a good exercise for me to spend some time um, playing chord progressions like that are associated with specific modes like this. It's pretty cool. Yeah, uh, it is for Koala Sampler. I can confirm from your question there in the chat. Uh, so the next one is like C and then D over G. Yeah. You know what I was working on recently is, um, uh, what's that song again? Time after time. I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to have to do a little bit of this now, actually. Sorry. Just not sorry. Sorry. Not sorry. <laughs> but I, I got to play a little bit of this now. If you're not, cause I want to like continue learning it and you will find me do, do, do time. At, but I'm going to probably stop sharing just in case, again, anyone from the Patreon is joining. Um, maybe I'll just check that periodically. This is helpful hearing someone who knows what they're doing. The only thing I really learned from my research was to ac accentuate that sharp fourth. Accentuate the sharp fourth. Interesting in the chord progression. The sharp fourth. Interesting. Let me go back to see which, which one you're talking about. See. So... You say accentuate, you just mean bring out the, you mean bring out the, sh yeah, when you, when you say accentuate, I'm just wondering what you mean in the chord progression. Um, let me know. And I want to go back to this song a little bit to show what that, what I was working on. And I guess we can go back to screen share since no one from the Patreon is up in here. And that again is I, I just don't want to have anyone hanging out uh, in the waiting room. I wish, I mean, I wish you were able to like get notified when you have a screen share. That's something that, that's a, that should be a simple thing for them to do, but I digress. All right, yeah, let's go to here. Time after dun, dun. Oh yeah. All right. Let's do this. And let's also bring in like, um, uh, pad menu or is really like, yeah, pad. Let's, let's check out these pads. All right, um, so I need to go to, I need to like find pads on here because there's so many sounds and it can be overwhelming, but I need to find ones that are like the ones that I, like just simple pads. That's not simple.
So I might just, I might see that. That's what's hard for me. It's like, I, I know the sound I'm looking for. I, I'm not hard. It's just take, it takes a while and I'm not as patient. Like I, I need the sound fast, but I have to like go through a whole bunch of sounds that I don't really. That's pretty good. I like these synth strings. I think we're onto something. Let's favorite that. All right. So this one, uh, yeah, you guys can see the screen, right? So it's like lying in my bed. I hear the clock tick and think of you. All right, let's bring that reverb down just a little bit. So, and this is a, a very easy chord progression here too, right? So if we just do all like the, we just do all like the root positions and I'm gonna get to the chat in just a second, guys. Um, when we just do all the root positions. It'll sound something like this. Lying in, bring that down a little bit. Lying in my bed. Wait, hang on. How's that? Lying in my bed. I hear the clock. Lying in my bed. I hear the clock tick and think of you. Bought up in circles. Confusion is nothing new. Flash, then it's like flashback, warm nights, almost left behind. Suitcase of memories, time after. Yeah, that's dope. And your love, and your God, and your bad, do, 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 time after time. If you're lost, if you're lost, if you're not, so not. oh, yeah, then it's. So that's the thing with chord progressions, like you have the freedom to figure out what sounds best to you, right? You don't have to um, play with a certain inversion um, just because the song sounds that way. So like, for example, so I might be like, if you're lost, if you're lost and you look, then you will find me. But I think, I think I actually like the different version of this. I think I did, let me see. Here. If you're lost and you're not in different. Uh -uh. Time. Uh -huh. So F at nine. That's it right there. Okay. So it's like G is like, if you're lost and you're not, and you will find me. Uh -huh. Time after. See, that's a little hard to do though. And the, let, me, let me go to let me go to piano. So it's like, so if you're lost and you're not, so this to this is easy. And then add nine just means go up. So this says F add nine. That means play a F major and then go up uh, a full step from the base from the root, two half steps. And then from here to play a G, you have to do, it's not that it's hard, it just takes a little bit of practice. You have to do a little manipulating. So you have this, then you have to keep the G, add a B, and add a what? Right here, but we might, we might actually, let me see. There's a few different ways you can do it, which is kind of dope. All right, let me see the chat. What y'all talking about? What y'all talking about? What y'all talking about? Uh, yeah, the sharp is what defines Lydian. So the fourth chord brings that out or draws. Ah, oh, wow. See, that's dope. I didn't know that. That's interesting. I have to remember to pump the brake. Since my NPC Live 2 is out of commission, I find myself in the tablet and iPad world thanks to Koala. I can still create and learn techniques. Yeah, totally, man. I mean, when you have so many different ways of making music, for me, it, it it's um it's a beautiful thing, first of all. It's not a bad thing. It can be just be distracting, right? You spend more time learning stuff, uh, learning how to use your equipment um, than anything else. So like for me, what I've been really loving about the OP1 field, in my experience, is that like I have... You know, let's take a look in the studio here. So I have like, um, let's see, let me turn this camera around. This is what I'm using, right? This Phantom right now, I have this microphone. And then I have over there, like I have a, a, a freaking flagship uh, Iridium, Waldorf Iridium synthesizer over there that just sounds incredible. I have my Ableton push over there. And then, you know, some other things, not really clean 
that, but it's, it's fine. But anyway, um, when I say clean, I mean like tidy, right? But so the thing is, is like having music and having um, the capability in, uh, to be able to use all this equipment uh, is, is awesome. But then like, it can be, like I said, um, a little bit distracting, learning a lot of different things. But when it comes to keyboards and for me being a pianist and a keyboardist, like I don't have to learn what everything on that synthesizer over there does. I can just like play with it and just like, I know what I know about keys. So that just has like a total different, um, sound, you know, to the keys. And it has something cool in it, which is called aftertouch, which like lets you press the key and like hold it after and press it even further down. And it, it sort of accentuates the, the sound and it's really, really an incredible piece of tech, but bringing back to the OP1 field, I, I bought a few, um, like small, uh, let's see, Y cables. So quarter inch, quarter inch to headphone and like small ones that I can just easily connect to like this keyboard, to that keyboard, to my, you know, right over here, this um, uh, Apogee um, Symphony. So like when I'm doing stuff on Ableton, but like being able to use the field as like a place where if I'm jamming out, I can quickly like grab what I'm playing and record it to tape on the field and then like go out somewhere later and like manipulate it further. Um, so it's sort of like, like I'm using it as like a recorder in a way um, to be able to capture anything that I'm, that I'm doing. And that's really just an incredible thing. I mean, I'm thinking about like the iPad, like sure, you know, that's, I guess, doable on the iPad too, right? I'm just trying to think out loud for a second. If I, I mean, it's, it's really not that, that doable. Uh, because you need an extra tool, right? You need like to connect the iPad to something that that, that lets you get sounds into it, um, like a, either in, in an interface or something like that. But with the field, it's just like, it's just the audio signal being routed directly to directly into it, which leads me to another point about like the iPad. I, I have like thoughts and opinions about, um, let me turn this down a little bit, thoughts and opinions about the, uh, uh, what am I saying? Like how serious or not how unserious uh, Apple is taking. Um, what am I saying? I'm just sitting. So let me pause. I'm 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 doing a ten day green smoothie uh, cleanse with my wife starting today, and uh, you know, it, the first day was challenging. Green smoothie for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and a few nuts, cashews, and like like a few vegetables, very light, like mixed around that. Uh, and so it was challenging. And so I need a little bit of water right now because water will give me some sustenance, not really sustenance, but just give me a little bit of something. But, um, <clears throat> so I digress, but yeah, so yeah, using the field for that, it's just been just, yeah, a lot of fun. I'm really grateful for teenage engineering for allowing me to have one of these and send it over to me and and you know just liking what i do so much so that 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 i i'm yeah it's just really amazing um so let's see i have to remember was making a was making a pun being a floor oh writing songs of oh i didn't see that let me see that's pretty dope wait you did say something about flirt flit flitian yeah 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 not just being a mode of all the naturals. Sorry, I had distracted from the plan lesson. I actually love this song, so I'll stop. It does work like a dope field recorder with the stereo upgrades. The original had nice sampling for lo-fi. Green smoothies get better. Did this did this years ago. Hey, dope. That's fire. Um, and don't apologize, man. Yeah, I I I really um enjoy doing these live streams. And even if there's like, you know, one person or two people in there, um, just being able to connect with people in this type of way is really very important um, for me, for what I do and for what's important to me. Um, and to have you guys have like this type of access to me as if I'm some superstar type person um, is great because I enjoy it. And um, yeah, but uh, the, the field, even with like that, there's another feature that just came out recently, like that shift when you go into like tape mode and you hit like shift, um and the red knob i think and you can change pan and you can change where you're recording into like that's that's i i didn't realize how dope that is coupled with the velocity sensitivity because now you're talking about like bringing hi-hats in going from this ear to this ear and all kind of stuff like that when you record it in 
it's just, it's yeah, it's just an incredible piece of equipment. All right. So we're going to go back to the song now. Think of you called up. All right. We're going to learn this a little bit more. So the issue or not issue, but we, we just played it using, we played it using this, uh, like nat, like our root positions of the chords. Circles confused. But there's another way we can play, right? We can do inversion. So we can do something like uh I don't remember which way I so uh, is that it? I think I like this better. Think of you caught up in circles. Confusion is nothing new. But I need like a I need a different sound here. Um so what was I just on? I was on like I was on this pad section and then I noticed what the strings, let me search for like strings from this pad section and see what, yeah, a lot of strings over here, but I mean a lot, lot. Mm, I don't remember which ones I was, I think these are favorites. So this is synth string. So if I go here and then I come out of favorites. Yeah, cool. So. Yeah, that's what you kind of want. You want some synth string action here. And you can also quickly, like, I, I want to start, like, like um, going in and, and um, uh, what do I want to do? Yeah, like, get more comfortable with the Phantom here. Th this keyboard is just, is an incredible piece of tech. And I want to, like, if I, right now, for example, I'm like, oh, I, I want to have another sound for the second channel. Boom. That's easy to do. You just tap the button and then you can, you know, layer sound very easily on here. So I might uh, add maybe even one more. So we got piano there. And then maybe for this third sound, what should we add for the third? Bum, bum. Maybe an electric piano over it or something. See, that's fire. Lying in my bed. I... Wait. Lying in my bed. I hear the clock tick and think of you. We need some reverb and make my voice spread a little more. Lying in my bed, I hear the clock thick and think of you. Caught up in circles, <laughs> caught up in circles, confusion is nothing new. Flashback, almost left behind. Sometimes you picture me, I'm walking too far ahead. You're calling, wait, you're calling to me. You're calling to me, I can't hear what you've said. Then you say, go slow, I'm on, I fall behind. The second hand unwind, and then it's so. All right, here we go. The second hand unwind. If you're lost and you're not and you're not by me, ah. So this is the part that's a little harder. So it's so this is where we left off at. We were saying that G to A minor. Okay, so let's let's figure this out. G to A minor. So we might even switch this and like do a different inversion. So we might do second inversion. And then how do we? Okay. So let me let me let you guys know what I'm doing here. That that's kind of important, right? 
So if we're at G and then to A minor, let's turn this off just to make sure no one's in that waiting room. No one's in that waiting room. Nope, nope, nope. All right, we're good. It's like, it's, yeah, no one's, no one's from Patreon's joining, right? I mean, come on. That's 20 minutes left in the session. Like, it's not happening. Before I continue, let me just take a look at this here. Um, do, 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 do. I have not done the firmware update yet. When I got it two weeks ago, I thought it came with Velocity update, but I'm basically all dollars in iOS, so I don't have a computer to do that. Oh, shoot, that's pretty wild. Go on to my brother soon to do some firmware updates on some other pieces of gear and jam with him a bit. He recently got a role in FP30 and Fire. That's awesome. And that's that's interesting about the not having access to a computer to be able to do the upgrades. Um, and, and yeah, Dawless, right? Like having just that mobile mentality of mobile gear is just like freaking incredible. Um, like like I said earlier, I can't wait till it gets, I can wait because my daughter's gonna be older and that's gonna be like, she's getting too big and she's eight months old now. But I, I'm looking forward to when the weather gets nicer. Um, excuse me. But anyway, what I was saying here is when you go from G minor, I mean, G major to A sharp, to A minor seven, so we know that what's happening there is we're just move, shifting to the right. But if if we're dealing with a um, with the inversion of this, we know that the we know that we're also going to be shifting to the right. How do I? I'm not doing a good job explaining this. We're shift. We're doing the same shift to the right, but we need to know that we're in second inversion of G minor of G major now. So therefore second inversion of A minor seven, we need to know what that looks like. And A minor seven second inversion is that shape of note, space, note, note, space, note, which is this, right? Note, space, note, note, space, note. So anyway, that wasn't probably a great job explaining, but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm on this cleanse, you know what I'm saying? I'm tired, I got no energy. You cannot, unfortunately, which is which is unfortunate. Yeah, you cannot do the update without a computer, or can you? Wait, 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 wait. Let me think. I don't know for one hundred percent certain. With one hundred percent certainty, um, there might be a way, right? Because all you're doing is you're 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 uh, what are you doing? You're connecting. You're connecting your OP1 to the computer and you're booting it up in this firmware update mode and then you're dragging the upgrade file into the root folder, something like that. So you should be able, you might be able to do it. I mean, try it out, I'm curious, but don't, actually don't try it. I don't want you to mess, mess up your feel. I, I mean, it'll either work or won't work. If it doesn't work, it's not, I don't think it's gonna even let you get that far. But um, yeah, what are you guys' New Year's resolutions? I'm curious. So. You know, we're in a new year now, and yeah, I have, I, I have, I have a lot on my mind. Um, I want to spend some time working a lot more on my tutoring and mentoring business and treating it more like a, um, treating it more like a business, you know what I'm saying? And really getting, getting that going uh, in a stronger way. And I'm excited for that. Uh oh, what happened here? It says stop sharing. Is it still sharing? I don't know. I just had a little error message that popped up. Um, and a lot of other things. Health. Um, more time with the family, quality time, date nights, weekly date nights with the wife, travel, read the Bible more. Um, I want to buy something for someone at like Chipotle or like a restaurant or somewhere where I'm like just placing the order. And then I'm like, Hey, just charge this card to the, whatever the person that comes after me, just like it's on me and not be there when they discover that that's what happened. But every time I think about doing it, I just, I'm just like, I'm like, Oh no, like, I, I don't know. I just don't do it, but I, I want to do that. So this year, maybe I will actually, I will do it this year. I just don't know the logistics of it because like, if I do that, are they, will they be able to charge the card retroactively in advance or something? Like, I don't know how that works, but I'm sure there's a way to do it. I don't know. We'll see. So 
All right, let's go back to the song. So that's the part of this that I need to really get down. We got 15 minutes left. Let's go ahead and do it. I will be waiting if you lost. So we were doing inversion. If you lost and you if you lost, you can look and you will find me. So there we go. That's why that's important. Because look, this gets us right into F add nine. If you're lost and you look, if you're lost, you can look and you will find me. So from here, this is almost F add nine, except we just need to move the E to F natural. See? And then what is G? There we go. Let's try that again. If you're lost and you look, if you're lost, you can look and you will find me. Time after time. Oh, so I have to just get better with that part of the song, but I'm close. If you're lost, you can look and you will find me. Time after time. If you're lost, you can look and you will. Oh. If you're lost, you can look and you will. Wait, oh. wait, what am I doing? Oh. Okay. If you're lost, you can look and you will find me. Time after time. Yeah, that's it. So we have to bring in. Let me see. That's that's what makes it a little hard, right? But I have to get better at that. I think that's a good fingering. Let me see. I'm not used to doing that as much with that this uh, second inversion. Also, if you guys haven't yet watched White Lotus, please, it's the best thing ever. And I'm just so devastated that the season is over. Absolutely devastated. So sad. It's such an amazing show. I did a firmware upgrade on the OP1, OPZ on my iPad. But I forgot. Oh, wow. It was like two years ago. My New Year's resolution to take music seriously this year. Fire. Myself and my wife are hoping to get our little music duo going. She's a, oh, that's incredible, man. Do you have a channel? If so, let me know. Um, like message me on Instagram or something. I, I need YouTube to, to get like a way for people to like, like, yo, hit me up on here on the platform. We don't have to go somewhere else, but they don't have that yet. But that's incredible been practicing my inversions and stuff like modal interchange i took music theory in high school but that was 20 years ago it's funny well i got something to say in a second 20 years ago and playing instruments that is basically only one note at a time i feel you you say 20 years ago i'm like wow okay 20 years high school but hey that's me too <laughs> i'm like damn high school is 20 years ago huh i mean just about i graduated what oh five so yeah i was in high school 20 years ago wow that makes me feel like old as shit <laughs> no not not really i'm good but that's interesting i never really realized that it's been 20 years since i was in high school whoa oh how about this are right, we gonna do another song lately there seems to be some insecurity about the way i feel where i want to be boo not there but you know it's with you all right, so let's see. No one can do the things you do to me. Never to be mistaken, long as it's love were. All right, here we go. Lately there, se Lately there seems to be some insecurity about the way i feel where i want to be girl you know it's with you no one can do the things you do to me 
never to be mistaken long as it's love we're making there's gonna be some rain gonna beat the pain but as long as i know girl time will show our love will grow and i know love will be right here be right here no fear have no fear no tears oh wait no tears love is here wait love will be right here right oh uh, whatever true love some don't believe in that's just what i'm giving this song is so fucking amazing i really love singing and um like i i really truly enjoy it and i need to do it more and maybe for january maybe what i'll do is each day or very often in january i'll like post a video of me playing and singing and I, like there's so many different avenues musically that that interests me and so when you talk about taking music seriously yeah let me do the same thing let's do the second verse true love some don't believe in that's just what i'm giving i'm gonna keep it strong i'll be holding on to you no one can do me like you do. It's true. Sure as the sun is shining. Sure as the sun is shining. Our love will keep on climbing. There's gonna be some rain. Gonna beat the pain. But as long as I know. Girl, time will show our love will grow. And I know love will be right here. Be right here. Right here. Be right here. No fear. Have no fear. No tears love is here s double s double u v s s double u v s double w u u v s s double u u v s double u v v s s double u v s s W V S W U V Ah That's so dope. That's so dope. Uh this is bad, but what's the name of that song? Is that an MJ original or did he just use the same progression? Ah, great call. That is um uh so this song is sampling the song that you're thinking of um which i'm going to do next right now just because we have to but this song is called uh swv right here swv is the name of the of the group and it's a freaking beautiful song um like really beautiful all right so let's go to and the song they sample is michael jackson human nature uh human nature lyrics and i, I also learned this a while Dang, where are they at? They're not like right on here. That's pretty weird, but whatever. You have to go to another app. That's fine. Looking out, doom, 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 across the nighttime, doom, doom. The city wakes a sleepless eye. So it's like, ah, but you know what? Let me, should I save? I should probably, I don't feel like it. No, I, should, I probably should save this. Let me save this scene. Um, see how, how lazy I get sometimes. Let's just uh I don't know what to call it. Sound, just because I really need to get to this other this other thing right right now. So we don't want to save it here. We want to save this at somewhere on C. Okay, like right here. Um, but there is a human nature 
um, seen by this dude called Narf Sounds, who was dope, and he created some scenes custom for the Phantom. Mm -hmm. Uh. and it's like yeah smooth love that here we go so it's like looking out doom 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 across the looking out do we need some reverb on my voice looking out Across the night time, the city wakes a sleepless eye. Hear, oh yeah, then we can bring this in. Hear her voice, shake my window. Sweet seducing signs, get me out into the night time. Four walls won't hold me tonight. If this world is just oh world, if this town is just an apple, then let me take a bite. And then this is the part I don't remember. If they say, oh yeah, if they say why, why? Tell them I don't remember the chords of this part of the song. Let me look them up now. Um, I do have a YouTube channel, but don't have much on there yet. I have a lot on my Instagram and TikTok, but it's a lot of ambient or semi-modular noise stuff, but I'll have more musical things coming. So yeah, please do hit me up on Instagram if you're on there, because I'd love to check out your stuff. Um, I might be following. As a matter of fact, let me see. Jeff, Ashley, are you, am I following you? Do I do I? know you and i just don't remember let's see i'm gonna look you up geoff ashley on instagram yeah this might be you here all right well i'm following you now some toys yeah cool so i'll check your stuff out for sure of course i'll do that you know what i'm saying of course that's what i'm talking about meeting new people you know this is good stuff right now this is good stuff very happy about that all right um what else am i uh i'm finally feeling better cody is saying I'm finally feeling better getting about better and getting better about my vocal placement while playing guitar and singing it's such a crazy feeling when you start getting it let me pause for a sec before reading anything else you're right it is a crazy feeling and it's beautiful and amazing um let me stop sharing this so we can kind of get ready to wrap up because i gotta go upstairs and watch this next episode of atlanta with my wife like i gotta do it um but it is it just feels so good and I used to um, do this when I was streaming on Twitch and because it was like fun to do there, so much fun, but I just kind of stopped. And my mind is just always, you know, different places. But like the idea is that people probably enjoy hearing me sing, some people, excuse me, and, you know, and, and communicating and talking and stuff. And so for me, I just need to figure out, do I want to, be streaming this type of content on YouTube or Twitch. And it's it's been years now of me thinking about one versus the other. Um, I'm I and I still don't know the answer to it. Part of me is like go all in on YouTube. Part of me is like, no, stay on YouTube, but also stream on Twitch for the Twitch type of content, like performing and stuff. Whereas YouTube is more talking and maybe more explaining things and teaching and stuff like that. Um, and then the other part of me is like, oh, just do them on both. I don't know the answer to it yet. I'm going to finish reading these because I need to get up out of here and go upstairs in a minute because I'm feeling a little exhausted. Uh, I've got five sons, so I don't have much time to prepare what I post. So it's not the greatest. They're getting older. So that's why this is the year I'm going to get. Ah, that's awesome. Five sons. Wow. What a. That's, wow. That's dope. What, what are their age range? Or maybe, maybe we'll talk about that next time. I'm trying to remember what it was about, but I recently saw a breakdown in analysis for human nature, probably because it's in that F Lydian, uh, that and landslide by fleet will Mac fire. I love when songs, you know, use similar chord progressions or identical, and maybe just change the order or something like that. Good for you, G. That's my plan as well as that. 
uh, well, I want to at least drop a beat tape and write more lyrics. Well, you know what, guys? Cody, I, am I following you on Insta too? Let me take let me take a look here real quick. Let's see. Cody, I think I might be. I don't know. Are you on Insta, Nathaniel? I don't know. Message me on there if you are. If not, then obviously YouTube is good. But just want to say thank guys. Thank you guys so much for joining. This was a lot of fun. And um, happy new year again. And hope you guys have an awesome rest of your days. And I look forward to seeing you guys on the next one. It's the equivalent to, uh, to patting your head while rubbing your belly is how to use. I uh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yes, yeah, for sure. Although it's although it's a little different. Although, I mean, I guess it could be that way like when you first start, maybe. Yeah. But um, appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. I'll see you guys on the next one. Um,